six, seven, yeah. game three right. for Con uh, Conrad okay. through for Mark. I like this idea, of course. You want to play two down, especially when you're behind. It gives you a better chance to win the game. Eh? So double four, that quickly straightens things out, two and two. Now you're really safe. And now Conrad re really wants to mix it up. So ace, deuce, ace, he covers up. And deuce, he may play six to four. Or split, yeah, splitting is actually better. When your opponent has a, an advanced anchor, you want to split right away. So you can catch, yeah, you stop some numbers. 6-2, that stops that. So that either hits twice or makes the bar. Uh, that's a good question. Probably hitting is typically wrong here, but it could be okay in this situation. Um, I'm not sure. Yeah, hitting twice is best. Clearly best. Yep, it's clearly best. This is a mistake. The midpoint is now stripped. And getting hit with a six puts you behind the eight ball, so to speak. And I see why it's right to do that. That keeps the initiative. And Black uh, and, and Conrad has two men on the roof, which you can't do much with, except enter. And this is the best way to keep the advantage, yes. Very good play by Mark. 5-4 comes right in with both. Now he's going to be hit and cover with something. Like 4-3 something, but ace. Oh, that's, not, that's nothing, you know. So that he's just going to have to play safe. There's nothing better. He's just going to go to the two-point. Yeah, and he's going to have a racing lead, and he's going to just play like that. Okay. So 6-3, that does something that goes, he's not really afraid. He can go to 11 and hope to make the 11 as a way, as a blocking point to block the, the 20 point. Uh, I think that's the right idea, I would do that, Genius would do that. And now he needs to hit and cover, can you do that? Yeah, he did that and he's gonna have to hit because he's got a better board. That's got to be right. And now coming in threes. What's that? One for sure. Two for sure. And I guess that just makes the three point standard. Uh, he's going to keep on hitting, I'm sure. Unless he was a nine. All right, double five, two. And two down. There is nothing better than that. I can't see it at least. Genius says it's pretty good. I say it's debatable, but mostly good than bad. Uh, a four ace, two one is still a big roll because it hits an ace, unless he misses it. All right, that, that now he wants to roll a deuce. A deuce really covers the four, that's a very good roll. Five and no good three. So either you're gonna, I think you can, you can play to the ace. The deuce would be really bad here, I think. Two, two the ace was better. Uh, by a little bit because now you get hit and now you're losing more in a race. Conrad really caught up here. Two and a six comes out and Conrad may double now. You know, he's just had enough of this. You know, he, he had enough and he sees that he has shots and blocks and, you know, and then that's it. He's not going to have it anymore, but he rolls, huh? Wow, he surprised me there. What's that? Six three? That makes the nine, right? If that's a six three. He misses, but he makes the nine. I expected him to cube, actually. How bad are... Oh, yeah, it was a missed cube. It six was, in fact, a missed cube. It was a, a small error, but I expect him to double these cubes, you know? Um, when he doesn't double these, I'm usually surprised, especially when it's right to cube. 6-1, and now if he rolls a 6-1, he'll just make the bar. Oh, did, did he, oh, he left a shot here? Yeah, he's probably losing the race. It's probably okay. Oh, it's, it's a blunder. Oh, he just needs not to be hit. Wow. Oh, and he gets rewarded by this somehow. And now, yeah, he didn't. Why didn't he double this? Was this a cube? Yeah, this yeah. must be a cube. By 30, genius. Genius sees everything, you know, he can't get by 30 cube on him. So 3-1, uh, I think you have to play safe, actually. I can't see, like, how you're going to leave the shot. 
That leaves a dude. Oh my god, what is that? Is that right? That, no, that's a mistake. That's just a mistake. Aces and bring it in. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, and now, why doesn't he double now? Why isn't there anything? I don't know. I mean, all right, so that's a fair roll. So now he does that. He plays to the three. And he's going to have to double next roll unless he gets to roll double five or something. That's like the best roll. Five, four. No, five, two. Five, two. Four, two? It's a five. So five, two. I think he should come out with the five and get the returns. Come out with the five and try to get the returns, I would say. I would probably come out. I, I can't see the value of staying back. Oh, you don't have a two if you come out. Oh, I see the problem. Okay. <laughs> I see the problem. You don't have a two. Okay. So six, four, that's obviously you clear. I don't understand why he doesn't double, by the way. I just don't get that. He's behind, and he's got a really good advantage. What's he waiting for? Three mark notes to live. And now he should double anyway. Why? Did he, was he playing on or something? It was I mean, small no double. Small no double Very before? Tiny yeah. no double. I would have doubled for sure. I mean, for me, it's like, now I would double too. Now I would just cube. What is the race? I mean, if I'm ahead by a bunch, I would. I would leave the shot here. I think. Would I? No, because I'm going to double. I thought it was six. Six? Oh, it's not enough. Wow. But he should have doubled when, the guy was, when Mark was sitting on the 23 point. I may not leave a shot now because it's what? It's it's a bunch of shots. Why would I do that? I mean, I'm probably in a good... Oh, it is the right play. It is massively right. Okay. <laughs> I, I would have I would have left a shot if I cube. I thought I didn't cube. I wouldn't want to leave a shot. But he gets returns. That's the nice part. If he rolls a 2, 6, 5, 3, it's four numbers, but at least you get a six shot back if he rolls a 5, 2. You don't want to come out because... The race is actually close, so you don't want to come out. You just go to the deuce, I think, or something like that. Or you place nine to two, I think. Yeah, you coming out is I would at least right on this. This is the right play, basically. It's all the same almost. Either going to the deuce or yeah, it's it's very close. But piling them up on the four was better, by very little. All right, and now what? How many pips is this now? Six ahead. Six ahead. He could probably still double, as far as I'm concerned. Uh, Mark is always going to take, of course. But there are some market losing sequences, of course. Oh, he did it. Mark is going to have to take. He's going to count. He's going to take. And there's no problem with this one. Obviously, there's no problem taking this two. Yeah, and it is, in fact... Cube, I believe, and a take. That's a correct. That's correct, right? Yeah. That was confirmed. Correct. Two, two. Oh, you should come out with all of them. All of them must come out. All of them. You know, you're just trying to play the race. You don't want to ever get gammoned and play six to four. You must be right. Of course. And now it's just a straight race. You know, six four. No, I plan, do I want to do that? Yeah, okay, okay. That's probably right. That puts checkers on good points. It's probably okay. You can't hold the guy. Six, five, six, something, five, three. Five, three? What's that? Yeah, okay. That doesn't waste anything. Okay, and he wants to bring four, two, four, and two, the ace, probably. Probably two, the ace. I don't know. Make the deuce is okay. Either one. Either one is good. You want to stack a little bit something there. This is reasonable. That's where you could the ace is a little better. Sixes? No. Did he? Oh my god. <laughs> what efficiency. What? Four one? Six one. Six one. Now this looks like uh, you know normally it would be a cube on the momentum thing. <laughs> but uh, you know, obviously the score at the score he must roll. He's ahead by how many pips? Oh my god! Unbelievable dice. It was five, so he had to roll. And now he's just gonna claim. Fives? Is that enough to take? 
Oh, he has two off, he has two off with the speed board. Three off. Three off. Oh, yeah, that's way too many, right? Yeah. Two, three versus two at the speed board going? Even. How does he even win this if he double, I mean, if he it takes? I don't even know what wins. So this is a monster pass, I'm sure. This is like a huge pass, like in my mind. And it is a huge pass, I was right. It was like, uh, he has like 12% to win. Genius is right on the number there, you know? <laughs> he knows the numbers, you know, it can't get by him. He called like 10, 12, you know, landing on 12. <laughs> so yeah, this is a big, big uh, fold, you know? What? No, don't tell me that. Ah, he always does that to trick me, you know, heart attack, you know? All right, all right. All right, so, okay, another win by Mark. I mean, I think he won, like, a bunch of games where he was holding down to the cube. Like, he hasn't, like, had good positions, but he won them. Aces, start the cube on two. Three. One. Perfect. All right, Conrad is going to double after a 5-4. Oh, double fours again. Okay. That's a big difference uh, than the 5-4. Sixes, and the cube is coming. If he doesn't cube, like, after this roll, I'm going to be shocked. An investigation is going to come up. Three, doesn't matter. Anything is a pass. It's just a pass. It doesn't matter. Yeah. It doesn't matter. He, he has to split or whatever but, and play to the deuce or to the four. And, but it's a pass, you know, I would never take it. I don't think it's a take. Is it? I mean, at that score? Is that a take? I would not at that score. Oh, it's just on the number. It's a take. It's a bare take. Wow. 970, he says. I would not have. I would not. You know, this is my style. You know, 987. Wow, it's just whatever decision he makes, it's going to be extremely borderline. -ish. I think practically he should pass. Um, I don't know. I don't mind. You know, I don't mind one way. Yeah. He, okay. What happened? He passed. he passed. Okay. Very good. Very good. I mean, either either way, either decision was fine actually. You know, I think it's. You know, if one side thinks that he's much better than the other, then I guess he would pass. Assuming he knows that it's this close. Four would have won, I see. Oh, no, two again. I'm uh, missing the number. All right, four, two. Very good. Five, that's a split. That's a split there. Yeah, very nice. And now a three or a one. A one is a good, and six is where? Down? Down, down huh? The wrong play. Genius knows this one. He called it down. He knew that play. He would have been hit. Oh, he hit it. Anyway, he gets it. But it would have been better the other way. Oh, yeah, you always go down. There's a trick. When there's like four men on the eight point, you always want to play down. That's a trick. Five, what? Two. Oh, two. Okay, two, two. The safety. And five is, of course, down. I don't slot the three. I mean, you could, but it must be very close. I don't know what the race is, but uh, it's got to be close. Yeah, down is better, slightly better. It must be because of the race. You just don't want to have blocks. Six what? Four? It's five, six. That goes there. That's probably reasonable. For lack of better thing to do. Five. That's the problem. Now he can't hit. Can he hit this? I, I don't know. Can he hit a goal the way? I guess he's consistent. He doesn't hit. That is correct. Yes. That's why I hated that play. So now we can play 11 and 4, huh? Would you play 2 down here, genius? I mean, what if he just plays 2 down to the, the 11 and the 9? Could he see that? Could you think Conrad could see that? I would play 2 down, personally. That's my style, you know, just because. I would play 2 down, just... Yeah, this makes it easy for Mark if he rolls a big set. Okay, and he rolled some big... Yeah, this was a mistake, the 6-2. Was it right to play two down? Yeah. It was. Genius, you're getting good now. When you see stuff like that. <laughs> now, double fours, this looks like the right idea to me. You know, you're, you're doing okay in the race. You're just trying to come home. You're not really making a board. You're not getting a shot. So this sort of thing makes it right. You're not, you're not getting a shot here. 
You're never getting the shot. This is in fact the right play. Confirm. Uh, okay, so he's gonna make the five, whatever, slot, slot, some, some, something, I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> this is correct, I assume. And this mark is just trying to roll uh, another joke, well, whatever, another double, whatever you wanna call it. Three, two, you make the five, you do this, this is fine. You keep a spare on the eight, it gives you a bad six, one, two plays, you roll it. Five, one is five and one, okay. And now he needs a double, any double will be in range of a cube. Six, two, he can't, he's gonna cover up some blocks here. I know that, for two. All right, uh, Conrad is gonna cover some blocks. Five, yeah, he covered. And now the double is coming, right? This is the perfect situation. Oh, I missed. Now typically some people make the one point. For me, it's always wrong. And I would just make the strong board, you know, for, I, I just, I don't know, I, I just hate this. I mean, I hate this and this could be right and I never play it and it's wrong, I'm right. But it's very close. <laughs> I mean, I hate that play, but it's close at least. So it's definitely reasonable. And he rolls 4-3 again. Okay, this time he has no choice. He fills it in. Yeah, he actually does transpose. Uh, genius again. You know, uh, okay, so Conrad has perfect uh, timing, I would say. 3-2, uh, he does to the 8 and to the 4. That's the wrong deuce. Always don't ever do that. <laughs> That's always a bad placement for the checker. You just don't want to do that. Put it there, you know, if you have a choice. 6-2, that covers. That covers, right? Am I missing something? So that just makes a full board. That's a very obvious move. E even I know that, you know, in my sleep I know this move. If I was dreaming, I couldn't play anything other than that. And now if he doubles, it's an easy take, of course. This is an easy take. You have a full board, any contact, any hit, it's gonna be a gammon. This is not a Q, probably. This is very bad. Uh, double threes, you know, obviously one of the best. And, 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 and you have to play, then you have to leave the two six. It's one of his best rolls. The double is really bad, right, guys? Yeah. This is really like a joke. Okay. It's a beaver, okay. It's nice to know that it's a beaver. Uh, it can't be, right? <laughs> <laughs> Two six? Oh, oh he got punished! <laughs> I can't believe this! This is crazy! I didn't even want to call that number, I was so scared. Oh my god, and now he gets to play on naturally, you know, we're just gonna... I mean, that was just a bad cube and punishment for that thing. Yeah, he just plays two down like that, yeah, that's correct. And Mark <coughs> is just not, not, he's been rewarded with some fantastic dice. And Conrad is just like super unlucky with the, the dice. 5-2, uh, of course. It's, yeah, or 2-4. Yeah, that's the right play. The board disaster with double sixes. 4-3, uh, and he's going to have to bring it in. Bring a guy in with the 3. That's right. See, I was carefully avoiding double sixes. 2-1, all right. I think it's to the 10 point because that play is perfect. After double sixes. Uh, six three, that does that leave a shot? Yeah, that leaves a shot. Uh, for the next roll. If he brings it in, and I think he should. So what? Double five, double uh, double six. That's it though. Four two, okay, four and from the five, of course. Safe, safe, safe. A do what the six is good, all sixes are good. Okay, the deuce is even good. Alright, so Conrad just wants to come in, he can't really get a shot unless a miracle. A five is bad. Sixes? Six, Six five. five. So of course, I don't know, it's better to come in, I guess. Five, two. All right, probably better to make the 11 maybe, but okay. It makes hardly a difference. Six, four, it looks like a gamut. It looks like he can't get out of this one. Oh no, not like that. So you wanna bring it in, right? But he's just setting it up for double sixes, I guess. All right, you roll double sixes, buddy. Bring your roll in, okay? Sixes! <laughs> oh, he knows it! <laughs> well, you know. He's actually going to save this easily, you know? Now, six, two, and it's saved. Uh, 
Very nice, very nice, Zaya. Let's go, Mark. Well, we need to see more games, otherwise it would not be as exciting. Wow, that was another exciting game. I'm just, I'm just amazed. I'm just amazed at all the, the, the numbers and the sequences and the craziness. You know, like you know the 2-6 is coming. It's so perfect. Mark was very unlucky there. It's like, you know it was coming, I should just call his numbers whenever he needs it. Now I know how you win tournaments, by the way, I'm taking notes myself, <laughs> you know? Play well and roll well. That's the key. Mark is playing well overall, I can see that, that this PR is, uh, you know, very, very strong, as good as anybody, really. Uh, five, what, five one, four one, something, five in slot, slot is better because of the score, again, you want to get into that situation where you can queue faster, 6-4, yeah, you have to do that. Uh, let's see, 5-1, is that when you must come in on the ace, genius? Yeah, this is too much because you're outboarded, the genius says. Very good, that's correct. 2-2, two and two. that is correct. 2-2, two and two and, the and if he fans, is this a play on genius? You're very good. Oh, and you cover the five. Okay. No play on, but he can't cube. Six five he runs. And ace typically he would link up or whatever. Some six is bad there. So he's gonna have to run with that, that's for sure. Six three goes to the eleven. There's no other play. That makes sense. Yeah. And now six four or nine is gonna hit. Mark can never double. Five three goes out. There's nothing better than that. Yeah. Two and a four and double six. Oh, it's, it's a blunder. Oh, it's what? What's a blunder? To run up. Oh, it's bad, so just put the pressure, put the pressure. 21. Oh, and do the fours. Put the pressure on. Oh, it's tough to see. Yeah, you, it's very important to hard stack the mid, Genius says. Yes, absolutely. I see it now. If you just look at it, like, quickly, you just say, okay, run. And then when you look at it closer, then you see, wow, this is better. Double aces is easy, of course. And now you really look at to hard stack the, the, the midpoint if it stays up. You just want to get those guys going. Five is very good. Three slots, something. That's typically wrong. Yeah, that's the three points is better than that. This is wrong. Uh, you just want to start starting points. You're going to make it most of the time. And you don't want to have those guys on a 5 and whatever. 5 2 is very good because he does that. And now, Mark is never really going to double. He, he's got too many bad rolls. Okay, 4 1 or whatever. See, he can never double. He understands that. Uh, he has too much work to do. Uh, at the score, he does not need <coughs> this to double. There's nothing really unless he knows where he's going. It's a hopeless cube, of course. 5-1 is a hit, you know, you, you, I think it's a hit, yeah, you hit. You don't need the cube. Oh, you can, oh, it's 2-5? Oh, I see, so you can hit, so you gotta do that. What? Uh, 2, two down, down is two better. Down. Oh, this is a huge error, actually. Because when you play 2 down, you have another spare on the, on the, on the 11. Oh, I see. A genius says when you roll a six, you got, that doesn't play well. Okay. Yeah, so that was an inaccuracy by Mark. You have to be careful about that one. Basically, you want to unstack the midpoint also. It kind of makes sense. You're more flexible by bringing two down. Anyway, now a fan, and now he's going to double. Uh, oh, he's careful now. Why did he double, by the way? Like, oh, double sixes. Yeah, that's, that's probably... Wow, is that the right play? Nope. <laughs> Not the right play. Now it's a play on, actually. Now this is like a play on. 6 4, it goes all the way. Yeah, it's only 3 6. 3 1, coming on the ace. Don't come in on the three. So I'm not going to play on. Hope that he doubles you. Hope. Hope that he doubles you. You know. What's that? 2 1? 2 1? Yeah. So obviously you don't leave a shot. Yeah, and now you just want to roll big or get out of there. Three two, that's two down. No, it's three two. I think that's just two down. 
Yeah, it's still down. Hope you rolled a 6 1 or 5 1. Yeah, you definitely don't step up either on this game. It's a bad move. 6 1, 6 2, yeah, yeah. Did you roll it? 6, oh, 6 3. That's a big difference there. He just wants to come in. He fans. Oh, no, he doesn't. What's that? 3 1 again? Okay. You must roll, of course. He's a shooty. 3 1. Should he hit or not? I guess he shouldn't, huh? He's just gonna have to play it unless he doesn't come out. 4-3, so just... I wouldn't even do that. I would just I would just slot the 6 as a crossover, 4-4. Four four. I mean, 6 and whatever. Yeah, he just wants to get the hell out of there. You know, he can never win this game. 3-1, just slot it. Oh, wait, this is the other shot. I mean, I would just slot it anyway, you know. Because it's a crossover and you can get gammon, that's why. I mean, I would just slot because of the crossover. It could be big. Genius agrees with me, that means I'm probably right. And he ki oh, what's this? <laughs> come on! Uh, oh, come on. <laughs> well, I must invoke my old friend, you know? I have a friend of mine, he once taught me a lesson, you know? This is what he said. You can never be too careful when you're gambling. <laughs> that applies to that one. When he doubled there, you know, he had to be careful, you know? That's it. I mean, I, that was an obvious play out, of course. Um, double fours, that's a great roll. And I think just the standard, even at that score, that's, there's some trickery here. I mean, I would just do that. And, uh, I don't know, is there some trickery involved with this sort of play? I don't like that. Is that, that, is that ge genius take that? Blunder, of course. Yeah, it's a blunder alert. That was blunder, all over. Six, and then four. Oh, he just plays for a blitz. All right, if, if he rolls bad, three, one. Really, uh, yeah, that's, that's, this gives him a big. Oh, threes, of course. So he should, and then step up, of course. And I wonder, he's not in the doubling range yet, but he's sure as hell close. Obviously, Mark is not going to step off to be hit, so he has to do this. A Q will be an easy take here. There's no need to <coughs> threat. Twos, he makes the board, and then he cubes. He makes the five-point board, and he cubes. And then the cube is coming. Even with a six-something, like six-one, <coughs> four-three, that's in, and now he cubes. There is a threat, double sixes, double threes. I would cube, genius does not like the take even, he cubes, I would, oh, I pass immediately, okay. That made it easy. Monster I'll, pass. Yeah, it's a monster pass, of course, very good. At the score, of course, you can never cube, you can never really afford to take these sort of positions. It makes perfect sense when you think about it. So four and two, the typical. And now Conrad is probably going to cube within like two rolls. Six, four, how do you play this? Genius, like that. That's the safest, I guess. A deuce gets in the cube, probably. Six, and that's six. No, what's that? Why? Is that right? Nah. You just make a contact play there. Four, yeah, what's that? Four, one, he has to do it like that. With a five, he's going to hit. I know him. No. 6 4, so he comes out with the 6 and <coughs> down with the 4, is my guess. It's too safe, I would say, for my case. Yeah, I was right, he should come out and down. Oh, that's a bad roll here. 5 1. Now, genius, is this where you pile him up? Because hitting on the 8 is silly. You must pile him up. You must do it. I mean, uh, he, he can't be hit here, he can't do the shot. Piling him up is, of course, the right play. Hitting on the ace is very, very bad. You don't want to expose another guy. There's no threat to even. Right. There's no gain. There's no gain, Mark. Oh, look at that cube flying. But that was a bad move by Mark. You know, he just, you know, he did it, you know, fast. And even when he works, he still has nothing, huh? 
I think this is the right play. I, I you know, basically, so you just want to button up. Okay. This is maybe five four six four. This is where you don't possibly. I don't think you run. I don't think so. If you get hit, you can get gamut. I don't think you run because you're not. What's a fifth count for? If you're not winning the race, you know. I don't think you run. Also after. Who's behind three foot? Uh, so maybe it is right to run. I just don't like it. It's not my style. It's really not my style to do it when I don't have anything. I would make the two point. And it, it is right to run. It's very close. Yeah, it is right to run. It's right. It's close by two percent. I don't. You know, I would probably make this move too. I just hate running. And he would have been missed. Six five makes a three point. If that's in fact the case. I like that over running, of course. You want the contact. Conrad is seeking the contact. He wants to make a stronger board and therefore have a better chance of gambling. Mark. What's that? 3 2? That's it. In covers. 4 3 is in covers. That's a good roll. What is it? 4 3. It looks like 4 3. Eight, yeah. So that's a very good roll. He, he buttoned up. He covered the board. I forget. It's a 3 3 three four board. Fan. And now he's going to run or I don't know if he can. If he rolls a 5, he'll do that. Oh, 6-5 is perfect. 6-5 is perfect. Now he's going to have to come in. Oh, fair. Now, Mark is never going to redouble here. He's not even close to anything. 6-1. I don't leave a shot. I, yeah, I do that. There's no need to make the bar here. This must be the right idea. Double 2, still fair. Need, still, he must roll. Hope to, hope to make a fourth po point in the board. 6-1, save. You don't make the bar. Yeah, you just put it like that. This is the right play, in fact. Four, and then the one is clear. You slot, you don't want to move forward. Makes it harder for Mark to come home. Oh, double fours! Maybe you should just bring him all down. Like, if you make a point and the guy, can, and, and Conrad comes in, he can't double. Yeah, you just, you're, if you're way ahead in the race, you just want to calm down. You don't need to hit. Yeah, and, and coming down is, is the correct play. This is the correct play, genius. You know, this is the wrong play because you could see why. If you just roll a five or a three, you have to continue rolling. And it's not even a position when you, you this is not even a position when you want to cube, you just want to play on. If he, if he fans, if he comes in, you can't cube. You know, here it is, five and you can't cube. Obviously this would be a hopeless cube. Yeah, that's four. So Mark now sees that he must roll, he understands, but he should have just brought them all down. Double deuces! Oh, this is genius. Genius, come on now. Now he's going to play on forever. This isn't even fair. He's going to play on forever. Four, and then one. He's going to have to leave the numbers. I think he should leave the number. Oh, two, one? Oh, four, two, yeah, just leave that. Oh, why, why, wait a minute, why not two down? Why not two down then? Yeah, double six is legal. Ah, what the hell? Is he looking that deep? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> well, you know, I, I think this is the right play. I mean, I would always do that. Um, I would leave the three six, I guess. Four is nothing, you know. Of course, he has to continue shooting until he three two, just bring it in. You just bring it in. You don't. You don't leave anything here. Uh, yeah, you definitely don't leave it. You just play to the four, I believe. Mark will do it. You know, of course. Um, and now a three is very good as usual, just to get out the G. This is like G. Wow. Of course, he's not thinking about the cube. What? Double three. All right, double three does the job here. <laughs> wow, I mean, you, could you ask for anything better than that, really? Yeah. Three, two, I think that's safe. You play to the four and to the deuce. <coughs> I don't do that. That's not my style. I think I got him gammon. I don't think I leave those numbers. And I am right. You have to play safe, safe, safe to the four and to the deuce. Uh, this is wrong, but not by much. It's very close. Oh, uh, well, of course he wasn't going to roll 6-5. <laughs> I mean, that would have been, you know, that just wouldn't have been right. 
sixes. Got it? Got it? Right. And now he's going to play for the Bee Gees, right? If he fans and he fans? No. It doesn't matter. It's just a gamut. It's just a gamut. Conrad is going to resign, I think. I don't even see a way. Double sixes. Three, one, two down, maybe two down. It doesn't matter. Yeah, I mean, within one row, it's like gin. Gin gamut. That's like gin. There's no way. Wow. What a turnaround, huh? What a turnaround. Really amazing, amazing game there. Another amazing game by Mark. I mean, he's like a magician. I mean, honestly, you know, like, I'm going to really, like, think about this game later on, and this is how you win in backgammon, you know? I'm going to try <laughs> to duplicate that in my own matches. <laughs> this is how you play, <laughs> and this is how you roll. 6-5, all right. Double 5, no, not that good. So this is where you hit on the ace and then, like, play 24-20, or I don't know. Or, I don't know, maybe 13-8 at 24-20. No, you don't hit here. It's a small area. It's almost nothing. But you step up and down. This is the right idea. I would have probably done that, I think. Yeah, this, oh, not that poor. You want to step up. If you do that, not that poor. That's the wrong four. You do want to step up and ha capture a high anchor when you do that. That's too much, especially at the score. Ace and three, well, no good three, so you do that. You hit, and then that, yeah. If he dances, that's a cue. Four, and that's a hitter. Yeah, Mark is kind of like safe here for the time being with that anchor, which is good at that score. Five, two, no, what, why, why go there? No, you don't want to do that. Why go there? Yeah, you should step up and down. One, two, and then you make the 20, the 20 point. What? Oh, like that. Oh, like that. Oh, wow, Mark. Very nice. It is second best, but it's very close. It's not the worst I've seen. It's, a, you know, very, very tricky, you know. But the one he wants to move up, for sure. All right, the five is duplicated, whatever. Uh, Connor doesn't have anything. And Mark is on roll. Three, one, covers. And now he needs to roll like double sixes or double fours. Or I don't know. I don't really know what he needs to roll. Three, two he needs to roll. All right, three and bring it in. All right, Mark can never double naturally. Six, four hits immediately. Notice after any fan or anything, there's never going to be a cube. Never, never, never. Never, ever, ever. Five and a three down, of course. Yeah, he's going to just keep on playing on this game. This is uh, no contest. Ace and four. He, he probably wants to unstack the six. Genius taught us that one. So this must be the right move. Unstacking the six. Very good. An ace and four. Six, one. No, five, four hits. Five, four hits. Mark sees it. He hits right away. He doesn't even think. You know, same as me. Uh, ace, four. Hits and covers. All right, we got a fighter. <laughs> All right, a fighter, yeah. Nice. Five, one, and he slots. And he slots the bar or something. Ace, five. What is he going to do? Command the ace and bring the five in? Isn't this the idea? This is the right play. In fact, it's massively correct, too. I see that. Six, one, makes the bar. Or? <laughs> oh, he saw that. Okay, okay, okay. So he must hit. All right, a five up. Oh, and he hits. Oh, it's a big hit. Two six, typically, you know, for the other side now. If he rolls two six, it's crazy. But he rolls aces or two one. That's also good. Notice, hitting, when hitting all these guys, he's getting, you know, five, six hits. And now maybe you should even consider doubling, as sick as that is. He's, he's just got too many men back. And where is the three? <laughs> Do you slot the three forward? Do you give him a four? I think that's fine. I don't know. I mean, I would play something like that. That is the correct play. Four, three, five. 
All right, so juice is needed to, so, you know, to, to equalize. Ace and the five is garbage to the ace, I guess. That must be correct. Now Mark is actually having a good game again. He can hit another guy. He doesn't. And that's correct. Three and five down. That's correct. That must be the right idea. He needs a nine. A double three is not very good, though. Fives? Oh, that hits, covers, does something. Hits, <laughs> covers, does. Hits, covers, makes the ace. That's it. Yeah. And Woody double now on a fan. Woody? How sick is that? I think I would, actually. I would. I, I would cube, you know? Okay, Genius agrees with the cube. I know this is a clear take, I think. Oh, it's a clear pass? Oh my god! Oh my god, how can he pass this? This is such a big money take, but at the score, it's such a huge pass. You know, he has like 37% to win. Wow! Very good, very good. Yeah, I would have been tricked. I would have been so tricked on this one. Yeah, I guess it's just too much, huh? The, the threat, the threat of getting hit there is just so big. Wow, that was really good by Mark. He needed to pass that. Wow, excellent, excellent. Very good. He's just playing the score. I guess that's a score thing, huh, genius? They got me on the score again, huh? <laughs> All right, 6-1, nice draw. 2-1, that's a split of some sort. What's that? What's that? <laughs> Is that a backhand move? That's got to be all the way. Yes, Carlos. very good, very good. That's the right play, of course. 6-3, is that a hitter? Did he roll 6-3 or 4-3? 4-3, four? Four, four he makes the defense a 4. I'm sure about that. You know what the score? If it's a 6-3, he hits. Oh yeah, maybe 20, oh yeah, yeah maybe, yeah, maybe to, uh, to the 20 and, and 7, right? 20 and 7 was correct, 20 and 7 was correct, double 3, so you make the board, I think you just make the board, I I don't know, do you, do you make the 21, genius? You just make the board, right? Yeah, that's, I hate that play, but I know it's right, I just hate that, and it is, uh, it's an error, right? It is an error. Yeah, it was right to make the genius move all out for the board. I know that play myself. And now he should, well, now he, what's the threat? Well, ace and deuce down, I guess, if you play it like that. That's probably okay, but then you have to double, I guess. Oh, 6-1, you make it. I guess you can't double, huh? I so want to double this, but I can't. 6-2? That doesn't hit. What is this roll? 6 2. That goes there. And I guess. Alright. Uh, yeah. That's gotta be reasonable. 4 2. You make it? Oh. I think you may not make it here, I swear. At that score with that thing. Uh, oh, I hate it, you know. Uh, it, I think if it, if it's a it's a mistake, I think it's a small mistake. I don't think it's a big mistake. Play to the 18, I don't like. That gives a lot. This is reasonable. I think it's going to be a small error. That's my guess. And it is an error. It's a very small error. I was right. Very very small. I don't. And act, the best play is actually to step up, and and, and safety. Uh, it, it it does like to step up. Uh, and safety, I would have. Uh, I don't know. I, I probably would have made this move. Making the four, the nine point is seventeen off. So, um, yeah, good. Wow, good, Mark. Good, nice, nice, very nice, very nice. That is the idea, actually. Wow, that is a tough play to make. You can all see that there's like at least four or five different options, which makes it really harder. Uh, the question is, do you step up or not? Um, and probably the reason for stepping up is that if he makes the three point, it's good. It's very, very strong, anyways. 
so he doesn't help to stay bad, I guess. He's gonna make the three as good as, ah, that doesn't do anything. Six, that would have been hit, it doesn't. And then I think he needs to play to the nine, to the, to the 10 point. This way double threes make the ace. I don't know, I think that's the right play. And, oh, yeah, it's the same. Both are the same, it doesn't matter. Either that one or that one, it's the same. All right, double three is still good, yeah, so it's the same. It doesn't make a difference. So uh, let's roll six three. Double fives makes a three point. And then he abandons the midpoint, makes a three. There's, you can't, you have to abandon the, the mid. I can't see where you can hold that. Oh, what are you gonna do? Make the ace and hold it? Mark, if that's the right play, you're a genius. If that's the right play, then you have to be this awkward. I've seen plays like this where it's okay to, uh, you know, to leave it, but I just, I'm not good enough to make that play. I don't think I'm good enough to make that play. It's not my style. Mark, did you invent something or is that good? It's not good. It's very bad. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, invented a hundred error there. Well, you know, I'm not, you know, like, like okay, you just want to be flexible. There's no gain here in doing that. Six five. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, what are you gonna do? Are you gonna, is he gonna hit? What? Yeah, he's gonna have to play safe and hit on the ace. I mean, can you actually bring it in and play thirteen eight, genius? No, not like that. That's bullshit. That's bullshit. That's total bullshit. That's bullshit. Yeah, that is a bullshit move right there. Five two makes a three though. That makes totally the three. I'll tell you what the six five was. I think I think you're supposed to just play hit, hit in and hit, in and hit. It was the right thing. That's what I wanted to do originally, and then I was thinking to just to just uh, play to the eight and hit and leave the eight shot. And then both plays were close. So he needs he needs something. He hasn't rolled anything. Ace three one, and now he's gonna actually. Oh wait, he has a four. Oh, he's probably gonna roll four. Double four. <laughs> Double two, how about that? Oh, he runs! Oh, oh the other one. Oh, okay. Notice Mark is never gonna double this still. This is not a double. This would be a very bad double because if he doubles and Conrad gets a shot, he would just double for four. So he can never cube this. No, you got nothing, buddy. You got nothing here. You just roll, you just get lucky, you, you hit him, whatever. This is, am I right? And I am right, massively right. Uh, it's one of those times <coughs> when I get it right. <laughs> but yeah, it's kind of scary that he's thinking about it. Uh, he has to see that basically the idea in these sort of positions when you're way ahead is to not have contact. And there's plenty of contact here. Very good, Mark. Now you must hit, because you have nothing better. And then when you get missed, you have to play on. Oh, no way! What the? Uh, what? What? Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, what? What? Really? Really? You can do a four? Oh, and now he just rolls, of course. Uh, that was too optimistic. What? Okay, Mark, you're just pretending. Yeah, double him out, buddy. Double him out. Go ahead. Double him out. Go ahead, he'll pass. He cubed, he pan, you know, he'll pass. That's pretty sick if he redoubles, you know, that's just, you know, that's sick because, you know, if he doesn't, you know, obviously. Where's the ace? Where's the ace? Did everybody see that? So he has to clear, I mean, he has to, yeah, he has to lift, of course. He must lift and he can never cue. Connor needs a four. Oh, from the five point genius, not the blocks. Yeah, four, 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 five. Okay, was that right? You, that was the right play? You made the right play. 3-2, how do you do this, genius? What uh, do, you, do you leave the 4-5 and 4-1, or do you just leave the 4-4? Four, four? Or leave nothing, actually, I like this. Yeah, that leaves nothing, well, you know, it's good. You give yourself aces and deuces. I like that play, actually. Very good play. Fair, and now he's just looking to bring those guys in all the way. Double A, double do, does it. I still would never double, you know. What do you roll? Six. So of course you don't just one block. 
obviously. Now the 4 1 is coming, we know that. I mean, there must be some justice. Where is the justice? Oh, the ace! Oh, the ace. 5 4, I don't know. 5 1, all right. It's just double 4, you know, nothing. Never happens. It's only in the movies. Never happens. Only in the movies, you know, double 4, you know. All right, it's not going to happen today. 4-1, uh, 4-2, four four whatever. Double 3 takes off something and something. All right, 2 off from the 3 and 5 to 2. How about that for a third move? You know, that leaves no numbers, you know? And 5 to the 2. And is that right? 6, well, no, five, um, I don't know. It's close. Cleared. Uh, I don't know, just to play, I would have made it that wrong by a little bit. I mean, there's hardly a difference here, really. I mean, I'm sure Mark just wants to get it over with. Defend. Defend. 6-2, okay, that's to the four, three point. That's a much safer move, I would guess, if you move it to the three. I don't think he's think, thinking about it. Uh, yeah, to the three, it's actually a big mistake if you take off. This is the right idea. You just need to win the game. It's much more important than winning the game. Uh, fan, six with a you know what. I don't even have to say it. Oh. Oh, you, know, well, you know that's coming. <laughs> and to do is you leave two less numbers now. Uh, typically, I would leave two less. That's my first instinct. Uh, I just don't want to get hit, so I would just do that. Um, that is my first instinct. And then I would have to think about why I would take a man off. I, is it safer for next roll if he fans? Uh, is it better to leave, you know, to take one more man off? It must be close. Uh, I'm thinking I'm gonna take a man off, honestly. Oh, it's, no, no, it's very close, in fact. Uh, six, four, six off. This is best by point oh, 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 oh. Eight. <laughs> All right, so it's better to leave less numbers. That is the answer. This came up in our match against uh, Denmark. Uh, we left two more numbers. This is usually wrong. And he shoots and scores. Uh, what? What is that? Six. Six, of course. Of course, we didn't really want to go home that early. You know? And then two. All right, and Mark still didn't lose, of course. 2 1, he comes in on the deuce, plays that ace. He's probably like a little sick right now. All right, he had this in hand. 7, 8, 2, 1 hits. You probably don't want to be double hit with the ace, so I don't know which ace exactly. Uh, I don't think it's to the 8, though, because I, I think it's fine. I think that's fine. This is 11 to 10 was best, but not to the 8 point. You don't leave the 2-6 to get hit twice, it's a bit too early. 2-4, no. 2-4 is better than fanning. 6-4, something 4. Something 4. I have a glare. 4-5, four, 4-6, four, yeah, of course, that's the right idea. Because now you can just make the bar. Ace, ace, 5 is good. Now either he makes the bar or hits, unless I'm missing some numbers. Did I miss something? He rolled badly, right? Because he didn't do it fast. <laughs> Two, three is like the worst. Oh, he did it. What's he thinking? <laughs> three. <laughs> he did it, you know? Like, he did it, buddy. You closed him out. What's, what, what was he thinking there? <laughs> All right, so at least Mark has some men off. Is that fives? Five, and the deuce is to the 11, so then that double five plays. Six, eight, nine, ten, five men off Mark has. One, that's a good roll. He gets oh, speed. And and uh, you know, speed, that's that speed is good. Aces hits, of course. Don't roll double aces, that can get you in trouble. So, all right, in Conrad, you have to close them out. Uh, do you do that? Uh, I, don't, I don't like that. You want to you wanna close from the seven point, not from the six. So yeah, you have to play 5-4, that's an obvious move. This is uh, very obvious, and now you want to take a man off I like know. that, but you can't, Let's 5. <laughs> and you have to, what happened? Yeah, oh, we got, we got tricked here with the, oh. 
We got tricked with the, 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 the scribe here, but it's okay. All right, do something. Improvise, improvise. Yeah, okay. <laughs> All right. So, 3-1, that's a very... 3-2, even better. A perfecta. And now, uh, Cartman is really winning this game. 5-1, of course, he takes the man up. This is where genius would really come in handy. He just would like the fix it all guy. You know, he would do it so fast your mind would spin. <laughs> two what? <laughs> two two? No, two three. Okay. Oh wow, he can roll like five or sixes. I know I feel it, you know? I feel it after that roll. Oh man. Alright, so now Conrad is really winning. Three two. Is he gonna play it safe? Yeah, I like this move actually, you know. I like that move and 3 1, a fan. He may leave a shot. He left the shot, right? And now any three? Any three would really make it close? Could make it close. Any three. And of course, he get No. Okay, alright. But I mean, really, we didn't want him to hit. 2 1, that doesn't mean much. I don't think he can win, actually. Three, that's good, but it's too late. Why didn't yeah, he do that before? I'm just a little bit here. Yeah. Yeah. So we got to get it. Alright, it's gin or gin ish or something. 4 6, 1, let's see. Can you want 2 1 2 1 2 1 2 1? <laughs> Alright, 5 3. You couldn't do that. So. Alright, uh, wow, what a turnaround. Finally, Conrad stole one bet. He was just so dead. I'm beginning to get scared, you know, when I see games like these, you know? like. Before you know it, the score is going to be tied. Seriously, I've seen this. It's like a nightmarish, you know, when you see games like this. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if it gets to be like 18 18 or something. <laughs> break, okay. In the middle of the action, we get a nice little break after another sick game.